Hey everybody, my name is Vera Jo Bustos, class of 2007 from West Las Vegas. And to all you athletes, I was asked to give some words of encouragement. And even though I can't pretend to imagine and understand the magnitude of what you all must be going through right now, I'll do my best to give you some words of encouragement. Some of the things going on kind of reminds me of my first days in Greece. I had no blueprint, no idea what to expect. Everything was unknown and I could barely communicate with anybody. Fear of the unknown was all around me. I myself was overcome with fear and cried myself to sleep my first night on Greek soil. As time went on though, I learned some powerful life lessons during those times of fear and uncertainty in my life. The first lesson I learned was living every day in the now. Being grateful for the things I did have instead of the things I didn't or the things that were taken away from me. I made it a habit to write down three things I was grateful for every single morning. I call them my golden nuggets and I still do it to this day. Not only did my perspectives change, but so did my overall joy and motivation. Although it's not easy to stay motivated and disciplined during times of adversity, I understand that. So I want you to think about your favorite movie for a moment. In most cases, the main character wants to achieve something, but must overcome adversity and conflict to get to it. It kind of feels like we're living in a movie today, doesn't it? It's a bit surreal. And I want you to take the script in your own hands and make your own blockbuster hit. Rise above the adversity and have a next play mentality. Because you see, just like a missed layup, a fumble, a missed goal, a drop stunt, whatever it may be, we can't go back and control the past. It happened, it's out of our hands. There's nothing we can do about it. Instead, I want you to live in the now. Be where your feet are, win the moment. And in order to win the moment, we have to focus on what's important now. Visualize with me for a minute. What's your goal, your aspiration? your dream hell deep within your heart. What habits can you create today to bring you closer to that goal? See this now as an opportunity to win the moment and become the best you that you can be. When your cleats touch that grass again or your sneakers touch the hardwood floor, imagine that feeling and remember why you continue to work hard. I never said it was gonna be easy and as a matter of fact, I think it's going to be really hard to maintain discipline, accountability, and have a sense of accomplishment during this time. So I'm gonna leave you with one thing that may help you attain these things every single day. It's extremely basic, but if you commit to this, you are going to get better at creating the habits and to stay on track for the aspirations and dreams you have for tomorrow. So every single day, you're gonna start the day by making your bed. I know, I know it's basic, stay with me. So let's say you wake up and you just don't feel good or your tummy hurts or you have a headache or you're sore from the workouts that you have, whatever it may be, but you make your bed anyway. That's establishing discipline. Now let's say you have an alarm set to work out, even that may be a virtual workout, and you set your alarm for p.m. instead of a.m. I used to do it all the time. Now you jump up because you're late and you're going to feel like you're late to the workout and you feel like there's more important things going on, but you make your bed anyway. That's establishing accountability. And at the very least, you start off every day with a sense of accomplishment by getting one thing done immediately. You see, we have no power over the past. We have no power over the future. Our only power is in the present. You are the present and you are the power. And remember to always find your golden nuggets.